Do you get a day off or...? You're going to marry a criminal, serving a life sentence, who you've never met, Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Hello. Hello and good morning. How would you feel if your daughter fell in love with a convict? A man, mind, she's never even met, and who is serving ten years in an American prison. She's planning to marry him. What do you do? Sina, why are you wanting to marry? Why are you intending to marry a man you've never met who's serv serving ten years in an American prison? Nita, no strain. Well, it is a bit of a strain because you have a bit, a bit of a... It's It's the worry. Yeah, but I'm you worried. started it all off. Do you feel guilty him. about this? In a way, yeah. Are you still writing to prisoners in America? I write to thirty of them. Thirty. Yeah. So, uh, uh, do you have a life outside writing to prisoners? No, not really. You I'm don't. Disabled too. What, what's your disability, your, your mother and daughter? Spinal problems. You both have both the same. Us, yeah. I saw you walk in here, OK? Mm -hmm. You're up so you can get around. It's not, we can get around. I'm not, I'm not, sometimes I'm not, we can, I'm not yeah. questioning you or judging you. Mm -hmm. I'm just trying to get the facts. So you could both clearly go out, couldn't you? You go out together to the shops, you could go to a yeah. club, you go to the pub. There's no... Yeah, but we can't be alone. What? We can't go anywhere on our own because we can fall <laughs> at any point. Oh, OK. Right, OK, so, so, but you need some people mm -hmm. who would understand you. But that's us. easy, so again, enough to do. I mean, <laughs> go together or you could be... A, so th there's nothing that's... You are not, what I'm getting at, I suppose, in a long way, convoluted way, is you're not housebound. No. No. So you no. could lead it as, more, as much as a normal life as anybody else, really. You could go to work and sit and do a sit-down job. No. You can't do a sit-down job. No, if we can, as my what doctor said... What do you do at home, then? Lie down all day? As my doctor said, I asked him about going to work. Right. And he said, if I can find a boss that will let me sit down, stand up and walk around, lay down, bend down, go home... What, all turn in five up, minutes? All day. <laughs> turn up when I can, yeah. if I can't get out of bed of a morning. If I can find a boss like that... OK. Tell OK, him. So, so... But that's... But, but both of you, your lives... Both the same. ...are very much then dedicated... Limited. ...is not limited or dedicated to writing to prisoners. Not our whole lives are dedicated to it, no. Well, why have you got so many Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Do you send him money? No, he sends me money. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> we, we haven't even been asked for money. Can I say, you're obviously very useful in a support role for these organisations, and I think that's the road you should be looking at going down. Why do you feel the need to get married? Because marriage is a completely different thing. You've done it, haven't you? I've done it, You've yeah. actually, I mean, you kept... Yeah. Yeah. You married a man in prison... Yeah. ..who's serving a life sentence. That's right, yeah. Who's serving a life sentence first for armed robbery... That's right. ..and now this is Charles uh, Manson. No, Bronson. Bronson. Well, that was his Bron previous Sorry, name. Yeah. He changed his Char name to Ali Charles Ahmed now. Yeah, but the name we all know him as is yeah. Charles Bronson, yeah. and who took a, a teacher prison officer, teacher, right, yeah. hostage, yeah. with a rope round his neck, carrying well, him around the not prison. All the details well, this are is true. What, this is what... OK, I'm just going on what's yeah. on public record. Yeah. You can correct that. Just but well, my public record is that he was carried and he tailed him around as a hostage, I think, for 48 hours with a noose round his neck and was given a further sentence for that. He's, and he, he, he's yeah. quite brazen about taking on the prison service and being the tough man and the strong man and will never be broken and beaten which probably well, suggests no, that he's going to spend the rest of his life in prison. No, no, no. Life sentence means different life sentences. I mean, my husband's got roughly four and a half years left to serve. Plus, we're just waiting for a major appeals coming up now uh, to quash his life sentence. So, um, Why he might even be... Well, Tell it, take us on from there, how you fell in love with the man First of that all, bank. I want to make a point. <coughs> none of us ever, none of us in here, chose the families where we come from. We all could have been in the same situation as Billy. It's not mm. our own, not our yeah, situation. We, were, yeah. we go straight up in, up in, in the beginning. You know, I mean, we could but have we been don't have to But if we'd have on. been in uh, okay. Cross McGlynn, we didn't have to marry the man down the road who no, was the terrorist. We could have married the man down the road who was the butcher. Go on, right, OK. I got to know him. <laughs> I, I, I meant the real butcher, <laughs> yeah. proper butcher. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you... Having a father, mother married to a criminal. Racial. Racial. Sorry, what's, what's the effect on you? 
Um, well, it's mostly my mum, because my mum and dad were always together out there and everything, so it was, um, it was hard when she come back and all she was doing was crying for what weeks. What do you mean, when she'd come back? When, when she'd, she'd come after back she'd left from it, court. And when she'd come back from court, when he was going to prison? Yeah, he, he was, was gone, did you, and... What was, was it like for you with him constantly going to court or going to, going to prison? Well, when they were going through it, it was OK. They, my mum, sort of, they went in the bedroom together and they were alone. Well, did you have to kind of act like support for your mum? Yeah, it was like waiting for it, really. <laughs> what? <clears throat> was it hard? Um, it, it was a strain mainly on uh, my younger sisters and my mother.